Good morning, Wolfpack. I'm Paul Sabulo. And I'm Noah C. Today is Thursday, October 28th, and we're here with your morning announcements. Look out for the Fall Fest tonight from 5 to 8 p.m. This event will take place in the CO Front Faculty Parking Lot and MP Room. Admission is free, however, tickets for the food fair, thrift shop, photo booth, and haunted house cost 50 cents each. It will be purchased at the event. Music, games, and the photo stop will be free. Make sure to wear your costumes. Do not wear masks that fully cover your face and be sure not to bring any fake weapons. And remember, this event is for CO students and staff only. Now check out last week's Spirit Week. Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. Sound right, boys. Looking great, guys. Come join us for our first History Day meeting today from 3.20 to 4.30 p.m. If you missed the information session, join the Google Classroom with the code shown to learn about the theme for this year. Attention all AP students, if you are planning on taking an AP exam, don't forget to join your AP classroom and pay for your AP test by November 1st. If you join or pay for it after that date, there is a $40 late fee. Come to Student Services if you have any questions. There is a fee waiver application available in Student Services as well, but you need to apply for that now in order to have enough time for it to be processed by the November 1st deadline. Now let's pa pass it on to Dylan and Josiah for sports. What's happening, Wolfpack? I'm Dylan Brazier. And I'm Josiah Edwards. Let's get into your sports update. Good job to our women's volleyball team on winning their first playoff game against Laguna Creek 3-0. Today they take on Folsom at home. Make sure to buy your tickets online before going. Tomorrow, our football team plays Elk Grove High at 7 p.m. Good luck, guys. Last, uh, last Wednesday was our women's tennis team senior night. Let's check it out. <laughs> Good job on the season, ladies. This Saturday, our cross-country team runs their league championship meet. Go get them, team. In baseball news, the Houston Astros and the Atlanta Braves are tied 1-1 in the World Series. Braves won game 1, 6-2, and the Astros won game 2, 7-2.
tomorrow Atlanta is at home for game three, and we'll see if the Astros can get some momentum. Thanks for tuning in to your sports update. Back to the anchor. Well, that's all we have for today, Wolfpack. I'm Paul Cibulo. And I'm Noah Seed. Remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy, Happy National, National Chocolate, Chocolate Day, Wolfpack. Wolfpack.